rappers gotta hold it down. Now they think they got it, cause they sign up on a doubt it. But there's only so much money in the year that is allotted. Plus, you probably don't even know how it is defined. What's up, people, YouTube? This is Rollout here bringing you guys another video to my channel today. And with this one, I'm bringing you guys a rushing route guide on the map Berserk, the newest DLC pack that we have at the moment. There's another one about to drop here soon. Uh, but I figured this was a pretty basic map, and I, I don't know how much people actually like this map, but I actually like it quite a bit. It's a very evenly three laned and you don't have a lot of options, but if you know how to play it right using head glitches and stuff, you can definitely do well on this map. So let's start with this side on this spawn, and I'd like you guys to know that you can actually use this as a wall run. If you didn't know that, uh, you probably did. You could go, let's hope I don't fail here. But you can go along the outside of that, and that's pretty useful. I don't ever really do it, though, because, I don't know, I'm a vagina, and I don't want to die. Anyways, like if that. you guys are not uh, afraid of dying, uh, don't really care, you think you might be able to use that wall run to get the jump on people who can. But anyways, this side of the map is a very, very hard place to get by, especially in like a domination game or something like that, because they're always flooding this side of the map. So, first off... I would recommend not to run through these doors because you're probably going to meet somebody standing in that door shooting at you or over there. I would say you should probably uh, go through this door right here or use that wall run and get over here. Um, and then use this little thing right here to your advantage. You can peek out and kill people. And when you know it's clear over here, if you want to get to beat on or there's a hard point over here, I believe, um, or anything like that, you can just use this wall run. But you, this is a really heavy area. You're going to get shot. There's going to be a lot of players over there so you really have to, to know what you're doing but if you're just purely trying to flank you can i'm pretty sure you can do this and uh, hold on let me let me perfect this real quick yeah you can do that you can get right across and people aren't going to expect you to come from the top of that they're just going to expect you to run from right there so if you get that run from back there and you boost off of that and over here, people aren't going to uh, to really expect it. Just keep in mind that this is just a really high risk area. So even though somebody's coming over the top of this and, and say you're the enemy player right now and you're shooting here, you can still easily, they can easily pick you off from midair. So there's no real solution to this side of the map in terms of being uh, sneaky because fuck, there's a giant gap here with open doors. There, you know, there's no cover. So, uh, take that as you will do what you wish with that information but that's pretty much all i have to say on this side of the map now let's go over here obviously you know these head glitches that everybody knows and is a death trap people are going to shoot at you from all directions this and uh right up here which if you're using an ar these are pretty good areas lmgs and any of that stuff this is a nice little head glitch right here you can shoot the people out of that window um, i tend to use that if the game has been started for a while and I spawn back here. It's, I think it's a pretty good idea just to, to, to try and get that shot on somebody, especially if you have an assault rifle. Just use this little head glitch, pick that person out, and then just move because they're just going to expect you to run to the middle and, and, and kill you. So it's not really worth it. Uh, but yeah. So first of all, I'd like to say this room is pointless. I don't know why this is here. Uh, this literally is not useful at all. It's just a random room at the back of the map. I guess if you want to call in your score streaks, this is a good place to do it. So if you push forward to this side of the map, and uh, you go down here, this is a wall run. If you guys did not know, I'm probably going to fall off of this. Oh, God, we're all right. Um, but that is a wall run right there. Also kind of pointless, but I think there's a hard point down in this section. So what I would recommend doing is if you know that there's a bunch of players on the other side of this waiting for, for people to flood right here, you can just jump up here, run around this wall, and uh, have a little bit of a jump on people. Also, another really, really good place to go is this wall run down here. In a domination game or something, you can get up here. And you're up here on this side of the map, onto, onto the bridge. If you go from that spawn to right here and you can get up here, I, it's another one of those high-risk things. If you can actually get up here, you might run into an enemy sitting here watching this way. Or sitting right here, literally where you're going to come up. Or somebody up here in this window. But... If you actually pull it off and they're not completely paying attention to you, you easily have a three or four piece right there just kind of waiting for, your, for, for you to get it. Um, like I already said, the middle of the map is pretty much a waste of time. But if you feel like you could do something fantastic, then go for it. That's just not typically what I like to do. Moving on to this side of the map, pushing forward. Uh, you get out here. Obviously, you can see where they're running up from their spawn. 
Uh, you're probably going to get caught right here by somebody running to those stairs or running to the middle of the map. So this is pretty much where this route ends. You basically, once you get to here, you should take advantage of whatever opportunities you have to kill. So since we're already on this side of the map, this is also a world run if you guys didn't put that together. Um, starting off on this side of the map, same scenario. You run to this side of the map. It's pretty much high risk, uh, high reward type of situation if you can actually get over there without dying in midair it's uh pretty pretty profitable but that's about it over here you have this window which is in my opinion the biggest advantage of this spawn i think this is the better spawn for sure uh, when you're over there all you have is this fucking cart in your way you can't see shit so this is definitely the better area to be obviously a lot of people camp up here don't stay there long because you get a you know a bunch of dick bags messaging you or something but um other than that, if you don't really care, then I guess just camp your little heart out. That's a good place to be. Middle of the map, I also feel like this side has the advantage. Uh, you get up here to the middle, you also have a head glitch right here that you can use. Um, this spawn over here is just generally better, in my opinion. Also, there's a, a hard point or something on this bridge, I believe. You also have more head glitches and things like that over here. You can use this to get right here, this wall run. Uh, to, to get around behind people and stuff like that. And then also, like I said, it's a very, very even map. Like I said before, three lane route map. And uh, you can use the same methods from that side, on this side. And they should work out pretty much the same. Although, like I said before, this side seems to have a little bit more of an advantage with this head glitch right here and this top room. Anyways, guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope these rushing routes were useful, and I hope you can use them in uh, your future games. It was pretty straightforward, nothing too fancy. Um, if you didn't know about some of these wall runs, I could see why that might be useful for you. But anyways, guys, deuces.